hey you guys welcome back to a new video today i want to do a house tour um actually this house is so aesthetic it deserves its own house tour and if you know me you know like i love good things i'm all about like house decor so when i saw this house i was like you know what my people also need to see so that you can also get ideas on how to arrange your house oh my god this this house is so so cute oh my you guys are going to just see it again i'm not lying so yeah let's get started also don't mind my hair this place is so humid and so hot i couldn't be bothered i just applied some small foundation and that's it but yeah let's let's get into this house tour because can you see the background yeah you can already tell that this house tour is going to be lit and i'm also going to like pick a few ideas here and there and i will incorporate in my house because bro this house <laughs> let's get started and you'll see it for yourself but then before we do that kindly like the video subscribe if you haven't to watch an ad or two and also share share the video and i'll appreciate also comment okay yeah let's get started so behind the couch she has placed a console table i'm saying she because this house has definitely been uh decorated by a lady i don't think i'm sorry guys but i don't think men are this creative so this is definitely a lady and this is so so cute guys when i got into this house uh i don't know i was speechless i was speechless because i was like this is the most aesthetic house i've ever seen honestly i'm sorry guys but this literally is the most aesthetic so yeah okay so on the console table so behind the couch she has placed a console table and on top of the console table there's a round mirror which is very creative because uh for me I don't think I would ever come up with this idea. If it was my house, I think if I didn't have like enough entryway, I wouldn't put a console table. But she has put hers behind the couch, which is a very good idea. I never thought of that. So that's nice. And then on top of the console table, the, she has placed some pampas glass and then a vase. So and then some two frames, as you can see, very cute. This other frame is so, so cute. The one with the leaf, bro, so, so cute. So yeah, that's behind the couch. That's how she has arranged the console table. So cute. Guys, I'm going to say so cute on this video so much. All right, let's get into the couch. This is the star of the show, okay? This is definitely the star of the show. So she has a gray couch. And this couch has good quality. Can you all see the quality? <sighs> so cute actually do you know what this is not gray i think this is cream i don't know which color uh aqua camera in a car but yeah that's how it looks like and then she has decorated the couch with a bunch of pillows this orange is popping can you all see the orange so so nice and then on the side she has placed like a throw blanket which is orange in color uh, I never thought orange would look this good, honestly. I never thought for a minute that orange would look this good. But now that I see it in action, I might even change my house completely into this um, this idea because it looks so, so nice. Anyway, so over here is a throw blanket that we were using yesterday. Those are my shoes. And yeah, that's how... The couch looks like and then let's get to this other side that has some curtains it's a bit sunny and it's in the morning uh but i love how this house is the light looks so so great so for the curtains she has put sheer curtains guys do you remember when i was telling you uh my house to that sheer curtains transforms a space can you all see can you all see how good it looks so so nice so if you're thinking of getting curtains just get sheer curtains and thank me later but yeah, that's how that other side looks like. I think the light is not great because of the sun, but I think you can see it. But bro, I am obsessed with this couch. Ob obsessed with a capital O with this couch. I'm so glad I get to film it for you guys and also for myself. Anytime I want to get an idea, I'll definitely be going back to this video. So yeah. So those are the curtains, that's the couch. And I love how this house is like quite small, but even the things that she has put in this house, see Mingi, 
so like it's quite spacious you can't even tell it's a small house i love it and then in the middle she has like a coffee table a round coffee table which is so cute and so dainty ah this is so so cute so yeah so for the carpet she has this black stripes carpet <laughs> i don't know how to explain but you can see and i think um the first carpet down there is white so i think she realized that it was getting dirty quite fast and then she added this one i'm just thinking that was the case because i don't know why anyone would put like two carpets but i think that's that's what happened the first carpet was white as you can see but it like it would get dirty quite fast and then she added the black one hey i'm just guessing okay <laughs> so this other side oh my god guys she has a accent chair in orange are you surprised <laughs> orange guys so can you all see how the orange is just popping this accent chair is so beautiful oh my goodness can you all see the legs ah, man this house is so beautiful and then she she has placed another pillow here that is so cute can you see the print in that pillowcase so so beautiful even these other pillows are so so beautiful yo anyway so that's the um, accent chair that looks so nice as you can see and then this other side there is a tv stand so right beside the tv stand there is a plant the plants you cannot miss a plant in your house if you don't have a plant in your house mm, i don't know you're not just you're just not doing it the right way plants add some pop of color in the house you know the green uh, can you all see how good it looks and then this is the tv stand as you can see personally i'm not a fan of open tv stands the ones that have um holes but this one looks nice as you all can see and then on top of the tv stand there is a tv of course and then down there there is a fake plant i think that's a fake plant and then beside the tv on this other side there's also a live plant and then she has planted it in water but they don't know if you know these guys but you can also plant plants in water nazitamea so yeah and then this other side there's a lampshade that is so cute and i think she really tried to match the house with the orange because can you all see it's also orange in color and then a lamp stand of course so yeah so one more view of the couch the accent chair and the tv stand and then of course i've already shown you the carpet and the the coffee table this other side there's also like a small rug i think as you can see she was really trying to cover up the white carpet so that it doesn't get dirty which makes sense so even when she added the other carpets it still looks okay surprisingly uh that is so nice and then the sheer curtains of course and the console that's me over there the console table and everything else oh on top there there's a lamp what is that called a light fixture yes very cute very nice and it's only one so there you have it guys so let's go to this other side that is the kitchen okay so there is this carpet a runner i think they're called that yeah kitchen runner that is so cute guys did you expect anything less <laughs> no <laughs> and then there's a cooker here very small and very cute like it fits this space perfectly and i love it love this so so much and then on the kitchen counter there is this is just um, a kitchen towel of course there is a microwave and then on top of the microwave there is a um, water heater some coasters more coasters are these also called coasters by the way the ones you place your plates on i know you understand what i'm saying and then the microwave of course and then this um dish rack and then some dishes even the dishes are aesthetic guys can you all see this plate this plate oh my goodness this is such a nice plate so 
yeah and then there's um what is this called you all can see it you all can see it and then this is glass like i love how she has attended to details like even the small things are so cute and then over there there's a sink of course and a fridge a small fridge that is perfect for this space and then there's um where you throw your dirty things what is the name of these things i don't know where my brain cells are today um yeah and then on top there are some cabinets she has just placed a few utensils and can you all see even the utensils are cute even the utensils are cute uh so yeah and then these are more cabinets i don't think there's anything here these are just empty but yeah those are the cabinets this house is so so cute you guys so so cute and then down here she also has more cabinets this is just gas i don't think there's anything else inside here nothing so yeah so one more time for the kitchen space those are the cabinets and then down there on top of the kitchen counter she has all those things as you can see and then down there are more cabinets the fridge the cooker and then the kitchen runner so yeah so that's the kitchen and then this is the sitting area and then this is the door this is where you get in all right so now that we're done with the sitting area let me show you the bedroom because the bedroom is even better it even looks better than the sitting area bro this house man this house is so so cute so yeah let's head to the bedroom i show you how it looks like and the bathroom oh my god it's a one bedroom house but yeah let's get into the bedroom and you'll see it for yourself all right you guys so this is how the bedroom looks like so so cute let me close the door so first of all there's this mirror and i look you just want to show you my outfit because it's cute can you all see so cute but let's get started here so on the side of the bed there's this carpet the black one and then there's this far white one that looks so so cute guys do you remember that i also have like a similar far carpet but i don't think i'd style mine like this because eh, it would i think i feel like it would get dirty very easily but i love what she has done with this space very cute and then on this other side there is a bedside table so so cute and then on top of it there are some fake plants and then this lampshade and then on top of the bed there are some pillows of course and then just a blanket <laughs> uh, what is the name of this and then this throw blanket and the texture the texture of this thing is so nice yo all right and then this other side there's also another bedside table and then some fake plants of course so one more look of the bedroom On top of the bed, there's also another um, light fixture. I don't know why, why I'm calling. I feel like there's another name, but I'm not remembering, so whatever. And then there's this mirror that you guys have seen, of course. And yeah, so, so cute. The bedroom, the bedroom is cute. The bedroom is cute. I feel like if she had those chopped pillows, oh, this would this would turn out so so nice. But it still looks nice, and yeah. And then this other side, there is a cabinet. Very nice. This is like where you put your dirty laundry. Just a basket, a basic basket. And then this is where. This is the ironing board. And it's yellow in color. Duh. This lady with the aesthetics. 
I love it. I love it. And then over here, there are just some curtains. And I love how she has added these curtains that block out the light. Because, of course, the shears are cute and everything. But when it's time to sleep, you will suffer. I don't know if I've ever mentioned this. But even in my house, guys, the sun wakes me up at 5. Imagine, because of the shear curtains. So I love what she has done with this. Like, yes, the shears are there. But she has also added this blocking these curtains that block out the light completely can you all see so yeah i love that i absolutely love that oh let me actually show you a sneak of how the outside looks like so cute oh, i love the plants i think i'll go outside and show you guys by the way i'll do that by the way so yeah that's how the bed looks like and yeah all right you guys so let me show you the washroom let me close this door so the first thing you get is a sink for washing your hands once you're done with your business of course and then a soap dish for washing your hands and then on this other side there's a towel holder and it looks like that i love how even the towels are so colorful like she knows there's so much white in this house so she has tried to add a pop of color here and there very cute and then there's a mirror on top of the sink and then a dustbin on top of it there's a toilet holder and then this other side is so cute and pretty oh my god i love it i've actually added some light so that you can clearly see it i love this so so much and she has placed it on top of the toilet this is such a good idea i feel like if you also have a toilet that is spacious you can add this so cute so the first on top of the is this a rug? I don't know what to call it. She has placed some flowers that are real. So cute. I think this one is called a money maker and it has grown all the way. It has grown all the way down. So cute. And then on the second one, she has just put some essentials like a toothbrush holder, a fresh freshener. What is this called? Yeah, that one, a toilet, and then just a basket to put in your essentials, but it's empty. And then down there is now the toilet. So, so cute. And then right beside the toilet, she has added a carpet. So cute. And then this other side, there's also a towel holder. Those are my gloves. Listen, I never leave these gloves anywhere I go because I know, I know they are a game changer. If you don't use this, when you're showering, ah, uh, you're missing out. I always carry those. And then this is the shower that is so beautiful. I have been taking this shower every single day twice because of how good it is. I don't know why the light is misbehaving. Yeah. So that's the shower. Yeah, that is so much better. And yeah, that's the shower place. And it looks nice. I want to put you on this shower gel. Bro, this shower gel smells divine. I don't even know how to explain. It, it smells like oh, so nice. So if you don't know where I can get this in Kenya, just... Comment down below because I would really love to get it myself. So guys, that's the tour of the bathroom. And then at the corner there, there is a bucket. So that's basically it. I don't think there is like anything else. And then that's just a brush to wipe the water. Magic Mwagika. But yeah, that's how the bathroom looks like. I must admit, 
that even the people who are building these houses they really knew what they were doing they really knew what they were doing if all the landlords in Kenya they would build their houses looking like this uh, we would be doing so great honestly we would so yeah that's basically it that's the bathroom and then the bedroom of course I've already shown you that yeah and I think that's it guys we are done with the house tour <laughs> Um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you've gotten an idea or two and Comment down below and tell me which was your favorite room Which one was the most breathtaking cause? Yeah, I was obsessed and I know you guys you all also love nice things and I'm pretty sure you're going to love this house tour. So comment down below and tell me which was your favorite part and yeah, I will see you on my next video, which happens to be a vlog. And I'm so excited. In fact, the moment I'm done uh, uploading this house tour, I'm starting to edit the vlog because, yo, I'm excited about the vlog. So yeah, that's basically it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. Bye.